here. You'll never get that back, Mike, though, unfortunately. He won't? Really? Don't buy it. Give it a kiss. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, now it's gold. It's got awesome, buddy. Good job, <laughs> yeah, man. That's what happens when you go to the Golden Arches and then come here. There's a guy on the back of it. Yeah. Yeah, stand up there with some spears or something. Oh, oh wow. Mikey! You did it! Wow. Oh, my goodness. Wow, Mike. I ran. Wow. <laughs> wow, look at that shot, Mike. Just found Roman gold over here. Good not have a better guy. Oh my god. Uh, I think that's a real deal, buddy. Huh? Oh my god. 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 Oh my Good job, man. That's why we're here, man, right there. That's the find of the century right there. Fist bump, Mike. Bam! Good job, brother. So right after the gold coin. <laughs> I think you won it, right? Yeah. Well, he really won it. <laughs> oh, yeah. I think you got one. No. There's stuff out here. Wow, good job, man. Thanks, man. Boom. Damn. Not a Roman gold, but I'll take it. That's on my bucket list for this trip was a bullhead. Man, that's awesome. They're sweet, sweet looking coins. All right, we gotta get to it. Fresh on. All right, man. So, hammered silver, gold coin. Gold coin. 18, early 1800s uh, bullhead silver, and I just got this pretty close to them. It's a green button, but look, it's got a, it's like a dog or a horse on it. Oh, that's old. And if you flip it over, it's, I think it's a button. Yeah, it's a button. This is where the shank broke off. That's an old button. That means something. I think it's a horse. That's cool. Yeah. Oh yeah, it is a horse. You can see yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. And it's got like a mane that kind of comes off of it, looks like, or something. That's sweet. Cool, man. That's a cool relic. Boom. Very nice. Breaker 1-9, Breaker 1-9. Pugmaster just got hammered. Nice. There's a farthing on it. The wind's really bad, so hopefully this is There's a farthing on it. Unless it's gold, it's just silver. Hey, it's still hammered and I love it. Somebody's got to be up to it, I got to get it in the sun, but when I turn, I'm in the wing. Nice. You can see the date you said on it? 1937. Very cool. We'll get a good picture of it in the wrap. It's a purple one. Target was coming out of the ground like mad. I had a high tone here. It was like 11... Gosh, what was it? Like 1140 something? Check it out. Got silver, I don't know what it is. That is shiny. Oh yeah, it's a thimble. Nice. Look at that. That's gotta be sterling. That has gotta be sterling. So I'm trying to keep the Trying to keep the wind off to my back, but the sun's also to my back. Sterling thimble. Very pretty. It's petite. Yeah, isn't that cool? It's got some fancy on it. Yeah. Okay. Good job. Cool. Fist bump. Alright, little Rosie. What did you
did you get? I almost thought it. It says, um, we don't really know what it is, but there's a six and then something between them and a nine. And then there's letters above it. Ah, it looks copper, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. It's got to be a player's uh, like token or uh, something like that, a player's piece. And it's kind of irregular. It's not perfectly round. Yeah, it's cool. So that's how you can tell it's old, too. Yeah, it's probably an old, uh, some sort of old token. I wish it was a copper's uh, coin. I want to... I want to find one of those bullhead coins. There's, there's been two found already. Chip on it. All right, little Rosie. She's I got, got, a got a copper, and it's a ship on a penny, <laughs> not on a coin. And it says it says eighteen something. Nineteen forty one. All right. Nice. Nice. No coin from nothing. It's a British wheatie. All right, had a. 1127 tone here which has been pretty good on this trip those tones have been pretty ranging all kinds of cool relics and i got a button and it's got initials on it so uh i don't know looks is it that way or is it this way i think it's the other way anyway it means something we'll figure it out here's the shank Looks almost like it's a military. Hmm. Yeah, we'll find out. guys day six uh, it's about 38 degrees and uh, it's like slushy rain but the fields in pretty good condition my very first target got a small musket ball probably from a pistol all right lead ball let's keep going all right Russ found an amazing find here oh yeah gold cufflinks 1899 and monogrammed and monogrammed look at that and then you got a hammy jeez louise that is gorgeous good job patience prevails yeah it does <laughs> all right let's keep going The guys are way down there and uh jeff just popped a uh, a large copper and i continued down my my row here got down to the end of the field and now i popped a large copper man this thing was screaming you guys it was a 1245 just a couple inches down you can see it right there let's pop it out wow it's thick that is a thick copper coin. Look how thick that is. Wow. Let's see if I can get some of the stuff off it here. I'll clean it up and uh, I'll come right back. I think I got one of those, uh, I think it's one of those cartwheel pennies because it's thick and you can kind of see a rim around it. Let me, uh, I'll show you. So if you look at it, you'll see there's like a, a rim around it. And there's a... Uh, A little bit of detail coming through. I think they have writing on the ends too, but anyway, yeah, pretty cool. That is a large, large copper coin. I don't know, that might be Britannia on the back there. The dates, maybe. 
Eh, we'll see. I'll get cleaned up and uh, there's a date. We'll show it in the wrap. All right, let's keep going. All right, still working my way around this uh, big field. I've been getting a lot of old lead and little fragments of like turtle bells, things like that. Just got a, a deep 1132 signal here. Got down to about nine inches and popped it out. Cleaned it off and it looks like it's a button, but I haven't seen one like this yet. It's kind of got a swirl pattern. It's concave. Uh, broke off shank, it looks like. All right, it's been a while since I found anything. It's been probably about half hour or so. Had a 1619 tone down here and I got this. Looks like it's a little button, but it's kind of got a cross on it. Pretty cool. Anyway, something to report. I've got a coin. Don't know what it is yet. It's probably a George by the size and color. But I always like finding coins, so I'll clean it up. I'll show you guys at the end of the day what it is and hopefully it's an older one. But either way, it's a coin. Alright, we're finally back on some coins. Had an 1134, about nine inches deep. I just dropped the copper. Let's take it over to the mud puddle here. Clean it off. Something on there. Now it's an Elizabeth. Yeah. Let's see. The date will be right there on the bottom. Eighteen eighty eight, is that right? You're eighteen eighty three. You zoom in a little bit. Eighteen eighty two. 1888 or 1882? 88 would be sweet. Cool. Alright, let's keep going. Sorry if my face is all cracked up, but uh, it's cold. The wind's cold. So I just got a silver. Uh, after the 1882, I believe, copper, I got a little silver here. And I believe it says it's 1810. had about two hours this is the last day of uh, some decent weather but now here comes the rain I can feel it's hitting it's gonna rain all day but check it out you guys my hole there it was down I could barely hear it I just popped this out it's definitely a silver I don't know what it is yet it's not hammered though because if you look at it it's got a reeded edge, See the reeded edge on it. I'm thinking it's one of those uh, Vicky six pences I'm we'll guessing it's it I'm guessing it's one of those Vicky uh, those six pence. It's probably like late eighteen hundreds probably. Alright, here comes the rain. It's time to get wet. Alright, we just came down to the edge of the field here where the road comes through and wraps around, thinking maybe there was some activity here. Found an old, old Roman uh, nail over here, I like got a bronze nail. And, you know, I come through here in the mud right, and I uh, got this. I don't think it's a button. Yeah, it's a copper. Cool. First one. 
last day. That's one copper and one silver. Let's keep going. Oh, just lost it. Really? No, sorry. Oh, but I lost my batoon. Anyway, I just got that copper, and here comes the hurricane coming off the water. Next target, a baton. A little flat button. Anyway, we're having a contest with Jeff and Seth and Virginia. We're all counting up our buttons, our silvers and our coppers, and we're having a little cash competition. All right, let's keep going. All right, next target. Got a little green coin. I think Virginia found one of these. I think it's a... I think it's like a farthing or something. Yeah. I hope you can get a date on it. Pretty cool. Alright. Let's keep going. Yeah, it says London. Yeah, everything's blown away. Even the lead bale seals are flying off my leg in the wind. All right, cool. Well, at fine. least it's not raining though. We're pretty happy.